Hey, Yaron, hey, hey, what's Mike? going on? How you doing? What's going Good on? You. What you got for me today? I have a very special ring here that uh, I made. See. Wow. Wow. Fancy intense yellow with hearts and arrow diamonds. Wow. So and wait, I don't understand. How come? Why do you need me? Like, you so don't I, you don't I, you don't you service like a whole bunch of stores all across the country? What's I the do, problem? I do all across the country. I, ser I sell price point items, and mm -hmm. this ring is actually something I made over a year ago. A very very special ring that this doesn't look like a price point. This looks handmade. This is handmade. It is handmade. It is handmade. It is handmade. I see. So that's why, I, let me guess, that's why you're not able to sell this because the guys you're dealing with prefer mass, mass, uh, you know, what's it called? Um, mass produced type price point items. Exactly, in quantity. And this is a one of one, one of a kind, amazing, Listen, amazing you, you stuff. Know, now I get it. Well, you know, I'm dealing with people with the final consumers and a lot of times people reach out to me to custom create things. And this will be great because, you know why it'll be great? Because now they don't have to actually wait. I could, the moment I picked it up and zoomed in, I was able to see the way that these diamonds are cut. Um, Correction, I meant to say the way piece. the diamonds are set. Definitely you not can tell made it's handmade. Overseas made, in, overseas, made in New York. Indeed. Color is nice. Certified? GIA certified. Ninety pointer looked like a carrot when I looked at it first. Okay, fancy intense yellow. Oh, okay, got the little star in there. So this is gonna cost a lot. And it's gonna look like it costs a lot, but it won't because it has that little star where the color was right. processed after it was mined. HPHD stands for high pressure, high temperature. High pressure, high temperature, which makes it more affordable. But I it's see. beautiful, I see. beautiful I piece. See. All right. Let me put this up on my social media. If anyone, uh, if anyone wants to scoop it up, I'll let you know. It's amazing. What are you looking for for this? Five thousand. Five thousand. Five thousand. You gotta be kidding me. To you. Five thousand to me. Five thousand to you. Listen, man. I'll see what I can do. Look what happens when you zoom in and you look closely, you see that, you see it's like a hearts and arrows cut. If you, if you know what I'm talking about, you look inside, you see the, the symmetrical uh, arrows shooting out, the eight uh, arrows shooting out from the center out to the edge of the stone. Properly cut stone. Nice. Same thing for the little diamonds on the sides. He didn't cut any corners when he put this together. The main thing that happened here is this is one of the first rings he created and then um, but he realized that custom custom work actually costs money. High end craftsmanship costs money. And if you're going to be traveling the world or traveling the country selling to, you know, jewelry shops, they need price point items. Uh, you know, I mean, some of them can do custom work when the order comes in but they are not going to stock that. Anyway, with the power of the internet, with my, my social media following, I'm gonna to try to help him find a, a new home for this beautiful ring. What's cool about this, I'll tell you, is this is a fancy intense yellow, but we know fancy color diamonds cost lots of money. You're not gonna to have to do that because it's HPHT, which means it started out off color when it was mined, but then the HPHD process got it to this fancy intense color. Fancy intense is one of the most desirable saturations for fancy colors. The only thing better than that is fancy vivid. And guess what? Fancy vivid didn't even exist uh, until like um, the late eighties or something like that. Um, so this was like for a long time, the most yellowest saturation. The reason I say it didn't exist is of course they existed but there was no term for them. It was just like everything was categorized as fancy intense until um, it took uh, some diamond dealers that I know. Um, they had to go back and forth with the GIA to prove to them you can't be categorizing everything as fancy intense because the vivids are actually even yellower. But this is a fancy intense, which means really nice color. Look at this thing sparkle, very symmetrical. 
The ring has a nice heftiness to it. It's solid all the way through. All these holes are drilled um, into a solid band. If this was a mass produced piece, it would be casted with the prongs already there. Oh, I could even tell that there's a little hallmark for the, for the workshop that he used to make it happen. That's also another sign. It's quality stuff. There's a hallmark next to the 18 karat, 18 K stamp. That means they're guaranteeing it's 18 karat or you can find them and go back to them and you know, you know, it's kind of like a signature. Okay, anyway, uh, the piece is available now. I don't know uh, how long it will be available, but if you're into this, I could obviously size it to any finger size. It does look amazing. And five grand is what he's asking. He's telling to me, but we could also make him an offer and see what happens. Because I'm, I'm I mean, I, as much as I'd like to help him at the end of the day, if there's a situation where we can negotiate a lower price for ourselves, doesn't hurt to ask, doesn't hurt to negotiate, we'll see what happens. It's definitely worth the money at five for sure. And uh, in case you're wondering what it'll look like on a woman's hand, oh my God, that thing sparkles. It's nice. This actually reminds me, I'll tell you one thing, folks, while you're looking at that. The truth is, very hard to find fancy intense yellow in a round shape. Because usually they're going to be either cushioned or radiant because those shapes get you more of a color saturation. Very hard to find it in a, in a round. Um, this reminds me of the time that, um, by the way, you can give it back to me. Reminds me of the time where I was in competition with Tiffany and Co. And they didn't even, the, my clients were looking for matching fancy intense yellow three carat rounds and they couldn't provide it, but I could. And um, that's when I realized that um, the rounds are actually more rare than I thought because Tiffany and Cole didn't even have the fancy intense yellow three carat in a round shape. They had cushion and radiant, but not in a round. Good. Um, there you have it, folks. Check out the ring. Let me know. If you call me, just tell me you want the the fancy, the 90 point round, the point 90 round fancy intense yellow. By the way, SI1 means it has very small inclusions, which are not visible to the naked eye. It's graded by the Gemological Institute of America, which is the most conservative when it comes to grading. All right, and while I have your attention, I have, I also want to show you other yellow diamond rings that I do have in stock, which I think are nice, depending on whatever carat weight you prefer or style you prefer, I have it in stock. That one has a, a mix of orange in it. It's a carat 92. Come in different shades and saturations, all different quality. That one's not a yellow one. That's a cool ring. That's a beautiful piece. Tons of options. Okay, let's see. This one's 2000. This one's 20 grand. This one is 9,000. This one's 30 grand. Suggested retail price on this is 63,000. It's nice and heavy. This one has a little bit of brown in it, very mature color. Golden brown kind of color. This one's 10,000. It's a platinum mounting with an additional, um, additional 40 points on each side with the half moons. Just a sample, okay? 
This one's on the website. Thanks for watching. Cut there, that's a square emerald asher cut there, that's a long bag special. Nine thousand one hundred dollars and it's yours. Wait and it's even better. You could also choose for free either this or this as a gift for scared of diamonds. Let's continue to the next one. It's twenty-six. You send me sixty five hundred dollars, this entire piece is yours. Plus, you get to choose from my collection of cluster studs for free. Along to the next one here, retail value twenty thousand eight hundred. The price on this is gonna be fifty five hundred dollars, and you can choose for the cluster studs. 